Hey guys, welcome back to my messy hair bun. So today they have a community garage sale going on. So I'm gonna walk around with baby girl. It's actually our first community garage sale. And we've lived here for like three years. So that's what we're gonna do right now. Uh, I try to get some steps in too. It's a good excuse to waste money. <laughs> if I find anything, I don't know. I'm just saying. The dramatic music in the background. Let me turn that off. Hi, baby girl. No, coffee, no. Coffee, no. Hi. 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 No, coffee, no. <laughs> you ready to go? Bye bye. Whoop. Okay. Oh, can you see me? So we got back. We bought a few things. I'll show you later. But I got sunburn. And I know, I don't think you can see it on the camera, but oh man, it hurts so bad. It hurts so bad. Look at that. Oh. So I didn't record where I was going because I felt awkward, like recording someone's house and stuff, but I'll show you what I got. And um, I was alone with the baby, so I was going up to the... Houses. I can't even move. It hurts so bad. <laughs> so, the hills we have here where I live in the community I live, um, they're pretty steep. So, I was pushing. I did the wrong thing instead of going downhill. Either way, I was going to have to go back uphill. I started up going uphill. Ooh, yeah. That was intense. So, we did that and then I was very upset because we found... You know the bicycle baby carriers that you put, um, you can hook them on? They have wheels. You should know what I'm talking about. Um, I had found one, but my husband was like, yeah, let's see if we can get it. But I had to wait for him to get out of work, and I didn't pay for it because I wasn't sure if my husband was going to like it. So when he got, um, not out of work, but on his break, when he got on his break and we went to go get it, it was gone. Of course. So that was upsetting. But we got a few cool stuff. And, um... Now we're home. I'm trying to put baby girl to sleep. Um, she doesn't want to eat anything, and my mom's saying it's because her teeth are hurting, which probably. But look at that. Like, I am so burnt. Like, it hurts so bad. <sighs> so, I think I'm going to start cooking and do that stuff and try to put baby girl to sleep. So, I'll see you in a minute. There's a literal thunderstorm, like a really bad thunderstorm going on. Anyways, so I'm making some guacamole. Look at this avocado. Tell me that is not the most perfect avocado you've ever seen. So I already have two in there. I'm going to put that one in and then I'll show you what else I'm putting in. Okay, so yeah, we cut the avocado. We put the avocado, put it in your bowl or wherever. And then use a spoon to grab everything out. So, yeah. yeah. You have avocado on your face. Here. Here. Mmm. So my husband likes to put in the seed, or the pepa, in the avocado mix because... <laughs> He says it doesn't brown as fast. There you go. Avocado for you. Alright, so you do that. I already have one in there, so I'm not going to do it. And then, I don't know where my stand is at the moment. I was going to stand you. Let me see if I find you. Okay, so I found the stand. Once you get the avocado in, you're going to use extra virgin olive oil. Just use a little bit. 
and use that to smash first. I already have one of the seeds in here. So you can use a bowl if you're Hispanic. I mean, most people know what this is. I think it's called filon. This looks so good. Like this is like the perfect <laughs> coloring you want. So just do that. I don't mash it too much. Yeah. Put that on the side. Then I do some salt, which apparently I don't have. Oh, here it is. Some salt. Again, to your liking. Wow. Some minced garlic. I do about a teaspoon. You like garlic in some So much to say. <laughs> Ground paprika. About half a teaspoon. Cayenne pepper. Teaspoon. You like it hot. My husband hates chili powder, but I like it. Teaspoon, half a teaspoon actually. And cumin. Half a teaspoon. So, cumin, chili powder, cayenne, and ground paprika. Minced garlic and salt. Cilantro leaves and some juice from a lemon. Hold on. Ah. <laughs> you excited? Oh. Yeah. So you can do this so if any of the seeds come out, you catch them. So half juice from a lemon. And I cut myself, I don't know how, because I feel the burn. If you have the juicer, you can, but my juicer is dirty at the moment, so that's why I'm doing it by hand. See, and the seeds are in there. Oh yeah, I cut myself, and I burnt myself. Then you mix. Yeah. Yeah. Then one of the ingredients I don't have, I ran out yesterday, which is tomato sauce. I mean, tomato sauce, tomato, and then onion as well. Just gonna put a little bit of onion. Not too much. Couldn't see my husband needs to use the rest of what we got for dinner. We're gonna have some pork chops with some corn. Too. What happened? You can't have onions. Well, technically you can. What? Onions to your liking. Alright, and then you taste it. everything. I always start small because well you just don't know. Let's see those into one. My husband likes it on avocado. I mean on toast. Mm. That's good. Want some?
thấy hay Baby approved. Okay, hi. Okay, so this is what I bought at the garage sales. This was $7, because my guest room is Paris. Isn't that cute? And then, I found this. And, it, and she was gonna give it to me for free. I told her I'll give her a dollar. She was like, it's staying. I was like, that's fine. Anyways, my son goes to first grade next year. So, the front doesn't have anything but the back. Probably with magic eraser and even then I'll figure something out. I still love it. So I got it for a dollar. Oh, I gave her a dollar. And then I bought this for my mom because she is obsessed with anything Christmas. And then it's from like her favorite crystal store which is called Mikasa. And it was five dollars. And then they also had these ornaments that were very mermaid. Oh man. $2 each box and then this little girl was selling this and I thought it was so cute for my daughter's room so I got it for a dollar in the set and then her sister makes bracelets that is the cutest thing ever so I bought two for her she calls this one flounder I thought it was the cutest thing ever and then my daughter I got her something hold on nee 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 I'll walk to let's walk Let's work. So I'm really excited that I was able to get her this because I had one when I was a kid. I just don't know where it is. So it's the Aerial Music Box and it's brand new. Like never used. So I guess that's how much she bought it for. We bought it for $8. And it had plastic and everything. I already took it off. But blue. There we go. Anyways, so there you go. That's Ariel. And that's the box. And the cutest thing. So we got that. Man, the camera doesn't show it too well, but holy cow. The wind is crazy. Here, look at that. Woo! It's chilly too. He's gonna grill in this. That's so funny. That's crazy. The temperature dropped real quick too. But like when it first started, it was so dark. Let me see if you can see it over there. My camera doesn't do it justice. Oh well. Oh yeah, and this is for dinner. Corn with cob pork chop and a baked potato or in Spanish maíz una chuletita con una papita <laughs> say goodbye bye we're done for the day um that was really good by the way oh I hate that feeling <laughs> oh my gosh, Ariela. What are we gonna do? I think we're just gonna watch, <laughs> watch a movie. We gotta go get her some diapers. Watch a movie and what? And get diapers. And relax. And relax. Oh, little girl. Alright, that's it for today. That was fun. We'll see you in the next one. Say bye. 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 Don't kiss. Mm. Bye. Good job. Mm. Mm.